Okay, so to officially do this, I got to go back a little bit. When I first got to Philly, I then the next day had to go out to Washington, D.C., meet up with Kay Murdoch, do a show out in Frederick, Maryland. So I'm going to start with that and then run it back. So actually, part two will kind of be more like part one. Oh, well, let's just start the show. I'm always digging in the crates and a while back a friend of mine was selling a bunch of like uh, novelty records and sometimes I get take the stuff just because it has a cool cover and this is one of them I got it's uh, Hammer Presents Dracula with Christopher Lee now y'all are probably like Christopher Lee but if you look close you might recognize that this brother right here is actually Count Dooku actually from Star Wars and actually he's also Sauron from the Lord of the Rings series that is the one and only Christopher Lee who's been an actor for a long time he's been playing bad guys for a long time this evidently. is from 1974 this is even before we were born so he does evil right we're in um, Frederick, Maryland just finished up the show at Cafe No. Went all right. I mean, uh, really, really great crowd. I'm just beat. I had a real uh, a lot of walking you didn't anticipate. Yeah, I got a serious workout today. I Tour guide fail on my part. My bad, man. How do you send somebody the wrong way in your own town? Go ahead, man. Come on, son. Come on, son. Hey, man, I was looking at the wrong let out place. He was I'm just glad. Map upside down. I'm just glad you didn't walk those extra four blocks. You've been really mad. But I made it. So now, this apparently is the after hour spot of Pretzel and Pizza Creations. Down on, I don't know what street we're on. <laughs> Somewhere downtown. Uh, the late night special is, is pizza, so I don't think you can order much else. Right. Excuse me. Uh -huh. So, yeah, that's it. Uh, showing really well. I gotta say, um, Justin from Radio Free Gamers uh, came out to the show. A lot of people came out. I was always happy to see folks from Twitter. And, so I'm Shout out to the homie Jamie right here putting on a good show. Jamie the Jizzle. <laughs> Jamie the Jizzle. No, man, we are uh, myself and Rand, obviously. He's doing camera work right now. Uh, performing in my home state of Maryland. I was saying that I started jumping off, and I know we were both weird about it because technically we haven't finished our first Kickstarter together. We had some technical difficulties that were out of our hands. I'll just say life got in the way, kind of precluded um, the DVD aspect happening from the first one. But we're making it up, man. We're going to do another DVD. Myself and Rand will edit it. We're both be getting our edit, our edit skills right. And we're trying to go to London this time around. Um, do a little UK excursion. And I wanted to title the Kickstarter and like, have a picture of the Chevy Chase uh, Lam National Lampoon's European Vacation thing. <laughs> But I don't have Photoshop skills like that to crop your face or my face over Chevy Chase. Or <laughs> I should have really told you about doing that, man. So, <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, we're trying to go to Europe from the London Anime. It's, it's actually called with the London Anime Club, right? Right. So yeah, that's end of July. So we need your support. Um, for those who want to help us get out there, it's really just the flights. The flights are expensive. I got a passport. I didn't have no stamps today. It wants a stamp. <laughs> it's lonely. So stamp it up. And um, on top of that, I think it's just cool because we. We know we got fans out there. I regularly ship packages out to London. I know you do too, man. Especially after the Black Material show. Uh, so it'd be nice to get out there and show some love to the, to the fans over in Europe and the UK. And hopefully this will be the start of us going international with taking this bits of rhymes thing. Yeah, man. I'll be on the road. So that's from my end. I got Teach Rap Hero uh, memorandum. And tour. Wow. Yeah. Um, I got um, an EP I'm doing. Um, I didn't want to give out a full record. I was like, I want to. I like doing things like how Rand has like right. a mixtape, just to vary it up. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So um, I have this EP. I called it the Ronin because, like, once again, playing off like 
like what I'm into, like uh, and Ronin being like a term for like a, a wandering samurai. So the, these seven tracks on the album. Plus, I'm real big on prime numbers. Like I like like three, you know, seven, oh eleven. Uh -huh. So seven, I was like, that's a good lucky number. Yeah. And I had Ooh, seven geez. tracks. Download the CD. I don't, I don't care. Like you don't have to buy a CD. But when I'm in your town, come, up to come through. Show. I'll sign it. Right. You know, like you know, mm -hmm. right. download the CD, but you can't download a T-shirt. Right. You know, and, and, yep. and you can't download a live show experience. Exactly. This so is crazy. therefore, download the CD. But when we come in your town, show love, and everything will be fine. I'm here with Kate Murdoch. He's actually holding the camera, so you can't actually see him yet. But um. At one of my favorite steak places, at least in, in South Philly, is Jim Steaks. So, um, we are trying to get the love up. Hey, what's some, uh, some cheese steak? So, therefore, yeah. Yeah. Do those people just carry those photos? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. Yeah, I don't know how they do that, man. What's that? It's all right. Like, did you just be like, here you go, I got a, I got a photo here, I'm going to sign for you. Or you just go to your car. Instead of the money, they just sign. That's currency. Okay, now I understand. The photo of yourself is, is currency. Yeah, basically, I'll get the same thing as him. I don't know if you remember. But... Yeah, son. <laughs> it's about to go down. God bless the child that got it going. Church. <laughs> Tabernacle priest. <laughs> wow. If you don't want to see this, it's going to get ugly. <laughs> so I'm going to cut this off now. Yo, so, just was walking down South Street and saw this really, really dope spot, so I had to do a little bit of um, plug in if I could. This is Raw at 608 South 5th Street. This is the new piece I'm about to pick up here. I kinda, That's it. I kind of dig that. This is crazy. All the comic books on it. Yeah, nah, that's when you're see, a super fan. See, I would think about getting these, but I'm sure they don't have my size. <laughs> yeah. so, oh my god! I'm a big play number, so <laughs> they don't—they probably don't even look cool with a picture. Like, it, it It'd be the actual right comic here. books. Them joints be so big. <laughs> all right, all right, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> that's enough. But yeah, so if you're in town, man, you gotta come through and represent, you know what I'm saying? Come through, check out Raw 608 South 5th. Work. So we're at the show, waiting to go warm at some point. I have a super surprise guest in the, in the audience today. And it's this lady right here. My mom. Like, we think we, we look a little alike. <laughs> That's because she's my mom. But um, it's really surprising for her to be here because usually you know, she's not normally at the show. So this is a this is a definite surprise and a plus. So um, yeah. Mom, how you doing? <laughs> Wendy Williams, how you doing? <laughs> All right, we're gonna edit this. But um, <laughs> she watches a lot of Wendy Williams. Put a camera on in front of people <laughs> to get a little out of character. But um, so yeah, it's gonna be exciting. I'm looking forward to it. I'm a rocket, and it's gonna be great. And mom's gonna be front row cheering the loudest. I'm energized now. It's a really uphill battle. She says she wants an iPad now. I tried to, uh, I gave her a laptop and she couldn't turn it on for the last seven months. So, iPad, I don't know. So we'll see about that.
we gotta learn how to use the stuff we got. She uh, she asked me the other day was I on um what did she say? On the book face? <laughs> uh, she said space book. <laughs> and I said I guess it's like a combination of MySpace and Facebook. So yeah, that's actually kind of interesting, right? That's some new stuff. I'm on the space book. But, um, but yeah, I'm just like, I guess getting a little antsy because I'm really ready to get on, man. Like, I've been here for quite some time. And, yeah. But it's been crazy. I'm going to need like a huge list of my credits of like all the people who came out to support me. two of those fights <laughs> it, 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 it went down but um so it's always a good feeling to come back on the block you know get to see everybody like I usually can't move like two seconds without you know like saying what's up to somebody but like good weather finally you know the weather's breaking I think it knows I'm leaving now <laughs> and um but yeah I had a really good time I always get a little it seemed like a little more homesick each time I come back so it's like when I first started coming back home it was like nah. now I'm starting to feel a little bit more but um, you know, it's a great place to visit. Um, great place to live too. I love the city of Philly and everybody in it. I got a chance to experience pretty much everything. We did the pop show. We saw like the comic book kind of side, video game side, things, all in one. So got a chance to experience some food. Of course, got cheesesteaks, got some culture. Bought a whole bunch of like shirts and gear. And now time to get on the plane and head back. So, I think I'm going to end the episode with this one. I don't have like a Jerry Springer style final thought, but um, there's no place like home. I was wasting
my time. All that did was make me stay on the grind side.